Wahoo! You watching GRTV? My favorite. Wahoo! So we've just seen Margin and the Forsaken Kingdoms looking really good. Um, particularly, I'm interested in the in the art style and the uh, the aesthetic of the game. Um, you mentioned that you're inspired by uh, European cities from uh, when you visited Europe. So um, could you talk a bit about what particularly inspired you? There is no uh, specific uh, buildings or specific towns in which uh, they have used as an inspiration for the game. However, uh, an overall idea of uh, European architecture and European art styles, uh, which is also seen in the Middle Age uh, fairy tales and uh, fairy tale picture books, um, are definitely used in this game, uh, and they are one of the main uh, elements that gave inspiration to the art direction for this game. And something else I found interesting is the relationship between the main character and uh, the margin. Um, you've sort of implemented this friendship level uh, to sort of signify this, this relationship as it grows. Uh, how does that work? As your friendship level increases in the gameplay, uh, the Majin will uh, be able to almost kind of read your your thoughts. Almost, he will know that when when you start a battle, you want him to attack a certain uh, enemy or to do a certain thing. He will start to learn throughout the game uh, as your friendship level increases. Uh, he will also uh, you can talk to the Majin at any point in the game uh, as your friendship level increases his comments to you become more friendly, uh, more, he becomes more happy when you do something uh, that is good, uh, or when you get a power up for yourself, he, he claps and is happy for you. Um, as the friendship level increases, the possibilities of uh, the battle also increase, uh, your combination attacks increase. Uh, various different elements uh, in the game are affected by this friendship level. Uh, but overall, as an idea for the friendship level, when your friendship level increases, you as a player will also feel like that you have become more of a friend to the Majin. Did you ever consider making the Majin directly controllable or controlled by a player in co-op perhaps? At the beginning, uh, they did consider uh, allowing the player to control the Majin, uh, but when they actually controlled the Majin, they found that it's very difficult to have an idea, uh, a feeling of friendship with a character that you yourself are controlling. Um, so, and also, when you are playing with the Majin, uh, if you are a, a good uh, player, uh, the Majin is more of a perfect uh, entity than he should be as a character. Um, so by giving him an AI, which is a little bit stupid, a little bit clumsy, sometimes trips on rocks, uh, it gives him kind of a personality that makes him more of a lovable character and uh, a lot easier to have the friendship, which is the core of the uh, gameplay element. And finally, you've announced a release date today, um, European releases first uh, and Japan coming in early 2011. Uh, is there a reason for the uh, Japanese version being uh, delayed by a number of months? So uh, the, one of the reasons why we decided to release it in Europe first is obviously uh, because uh, we have re received so much insp inspiration from the various European countries and uh, also the full uh, voice and text localization to all of the languages. Uh, we would definitely like the European territories to uh, be able to play with it first. Um, the reason why we have uh, delayed the Japanese release is uh, because in America and in Europe, uh, we have considered uh, many different uh, timings of uh, the release uh, in order to uh, fully take uh, advantage of the potential uh, of this game. Um, also in the Japanese regions, uh, we are going to uh, look at uh, the reactions of the Western audiences and also take that into consideration with the Japanese release, uh, as well as uh, keeping in mind uh, the timing of the release to make sure that uh, we can take full advantage of this new IP, even in the uh, Japanese region. Excellent. I look forward to playing it. Thank you both.